in their sleep, and then the next morning when you try to tell them that you just got. Yo, what's up guys? It's your boy Sean Wisdom here and I'm so happy to bring you another spicy episode of Oh So It's Funny Now. Now think back. Do you know anyone? Call them out. Call them out in the comments. Call them out when you show them this video and let them know that they're the person that sleeps and they whoop your ass when they're asleep. Well, I was that person in like 2006 so grab a drink kick your feet up grab the family and i got a story to tell you back in 06 your boy was a slick and handsome 13 years old just chilling with my mom and sister at big lots my little sister was about five years old then and we didn't get along like we do now I'll tell you what so we were always, always at each other's necks, fighting about something at all times. As they shopped around for stuff that wasn't as fun, I snooped around to see if I could find something that would kind of pique my interest. The toy aisle was a barren wasteland of knockoff toys like Yugi Mon and Super Rangers. So there was no luck there for me. I stumbled upon a gold mine, people. I found a bin, a discount container full of PS1 games. I dove into this container full of games and snooped around like Scrooge McDuck diving into a bottomless pit of gold coins, searching and hunting for the perfect game. While digging through this endless mountain of games, I found something that I never heard of before. It was a game called King of Fighters 99. King of Fighters? I thought as I yanked the game from the pile and I looked at the back for more info, in screenshots of flashy finishing moves, over the top character design, and the 2D sprite style that reminded me of old school Killer Instinct. I was hooked. I had to have it. Killer Instinct. I rushed through the aisles looking for my mom and after a little bit of coaxing, we were able to take the game home. My sister and I rushed inside to play with our new finds from Big Lots and kind of sort of left my mom with a bunch of the groceries and stuff to get out of the car so we you know we that wasn't right that wasn't fair that wasn't cool why did we do that i don't know what was going on i was too hype i was in fight mode i sat down smashed the game into my ps1 and i started grinding away for about six hours before my mom tapped me on the shoulder and said it was time to go to bed for school tomorrow i was pissed i was bummed I was in the zone, man. I was learning all the intricacies of the game. Punch, kick, dodge, punch, kick, dodge, punch, kick, dodge. I kept repeating the words in my head as I dozed off the bed. As I was dreaming, you know, as you do, I dreamed that I was a great fighter in this tournament, fighting for the girl that I loved, fighting for the country that I loved, defeating every adversary that stood against me anybody anyone that wanted it they got the smoke they got the hands they got the special moves they got the backflip kicks they got the fireballs uppercuts all of it and then i was yanked back into reality with some real life combos from my mom i didn't know what to think of it i was just i just woke up i woke up to an angry mother and a crying little sister I look at my mom through now my tears and snot and wondered, what did I do? What did I do? She looks at me and she says, you punched him. You punched Angel in your sleep. You're too worried about that game. You know what? We're taking it. We're getting rid of it. And I said, punched Angel in her sleep? What are you talking about? I would never lay a finger on my beautiful baby sister that never did anything wrong ever in my life. And I loved her so much. I didn't know what to think. She said that I didn't wake up in time and uh, they had breakfast ready. My sister went in my room to wake me up. She hopped on my bed. I was rolling around. And as my sister tapped me on the face, I just ripped a right hand at her. Just I didn't know what to do. I thought I was I thought that I was getting hit. If you were able to ask me 
I was the king of fighters. I was the king of all fighters. In reality, I was just, um, I was just 13 and late for school. So I'm sure you guys can guess that king of fighters disappeared for a while and so did I. I was grounded for a little bit after that and um, you know, well-deserved, well-deserved. If anyone wants the hands in King of Fighters 99, buy a copy, turn on the easy combo mode, come meet me at my apartment because I'm down to play, I'm trying to win some money. Spoiler alert, I got grounded, got my ass whooped, got my game taken away. Thanks for tuning in to this episode of Oh So It's Funny Now. I don't know if I'm a... Um, stay with this setup with them holding the mic but um you know it kind of feels like i'm on a talk show or something so i'm talking with all my boys you know talking to all my boys on the talk show on the talk make sure that you guys like comment subscribe and share and i'm gonna try to stay a little bit more consistent with the uploads um i get lazy